All right, we're getting some medicine ready because Penelope, we noticed, started having diarrhea. And then the other goat started having diarrhea, so we took her to the vet, and they said she has worms. Oh boy. Oh boy. I got that, but the fence is on. Don't, don't do it. Don't do it, Buck. Don't do it, Duker. Look, mama chicken's running to me. Take your medicine, Wormy. Oh, made a mess. Sorry. All right, next. Go. You got a messy rear. He has a messy rear end. Can you show me, Duke? Yeah. Okay, get down. So she has it the worst. We actually took poop samples off her back. And uh, we gave her a bath yesterday, so she was clean. But, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, medicine time. Y'all like this, don't you? You like, you like this medicine? Oh yeah, she's like, put it in there. Oh, are you gonna fight me, puppy? <laughs> Princess Penelope hates everything, but she likes this medicine. <laughs> here you go. Here you some milk. Here, I got you a towel to put your knees on. Hey. It helps if you like let some air in, Princess. Not on. Like it, like her, where it poops and her little tail wags. It's like on her side. Poor girl. You're not gonna jump up on my back today. <laughs> You're gonna stay right there. She wasn't that bad yesterday, and I let her jump up on my back, but not today. <laughs> so a couple hours after her first dose, she was already feeling better. I mean, she's been acting pretty lethargic. She's she always eats. She's always out here eating grass. We thought that she might have bloat because her stomach is really hard, but it's not too bad anymore. It's pretty soft. <clears throat> oh my gosh! Nope. I said no jumping up on my back, yo. She did it. I know, we'll get you cleaned up and we'll get you back on my back, my back, my little buddy. <laughs> hey, Buck. You chuckle. Oh, Duker. All right, it's time for nightly medicine. <laughs> We're running the two-man crew, so I can't film giving Duker it, because he's a pill. But then you got these guys. You take out them? Yeah. You gonna take it? You really take it. Yeah, yeah. It's like, I like it. It tastes like oranges, or at least it smells like oranges. <laughs> Good boy, Chaco. You got some more? You got some more? Get some more of that orange crack. Oh, you gotta get. Oh my gosh, come on. Come on. No hooves on me. Crawl, crawl on my leg. Okay, okay. Alright, we get bottles. But 
Come here, bud. Duke. Come here. Come here. Hey, look. Look. Get some, here. Get some here. tail action. Here, Duke. Duke, come here. Duke. He's like sucking my finger. Come here. <laughs> here, I'll bring him over here. here. Yeah, dear. Triple milking action going on. Nope. Duke likes to be held. <laughs> and so does Buck. Love it. <laughs> He's like, I want the one that he has. Duke, my man. <laughs> Alright. Come on. <laughs> he won't take his medicine. And he won't take a bottle unless he's being held. This guy's a spoiled little kid. But he sure is cute. He kind of is. <laughs> Look at those gorgeous eyes. Yes. Isn't he a sweetheart? <laughs> and he sounds like a rinty pig. Again, you want some more? Enough. The whole time we're trying to give him medicine, he's going, mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. I swear, one says, sounds like, mm -mm, and the other one sounds like, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. oh my gosh. I hear you girls. Just a minute. You gotta think about it. Ponder the meaning of life. See if you want some. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> no? Are you full, Duke? Are you full? <laughs> it's like a sign. That means he's satisfied. <laughs> that means he's satisfied. All right, this is night number two of giving the goats. Three. Night number oh, number three. Friday was the first night with medicine, and then Saturday, today, mm. Sunday. So yes, night three. And they didn't give us enough medicine, so we got to go back tomorrow to the vet. Yeah. Uh, yeah, we haven't been this much. We haven't gone to the vet this much in years. Yeah. Thank you, goats. <laughs> But we'll keep you updated on uh, on the goat uh, diarrhea issues, which is caused by the worms. But the good thing is, so I only had enough medicine tonight for one dose for one big goat. So we chose to give it to Penelope since she's the one that's well, was tested and has really bad case of worms. So we gave it to her, which she loves it, so that was easy. Um, and then she actually drank four ounces of milk, and she hasn't done that and wanted more. Ever. Yeah, she wanted more, but then she was, I had more for her and she was a Miss Pris because somebody else drank from the bottle first and since she's a princess, she <laughs> oh can't God. drink from commoner bottles, apparently. Anyway, but um, she's never drank that much before, has she? Like when we first were giving them, I mean, she drank kind of good at the beginning, but I don't think she ever drank more than two ounces. Yeah, they got up systemic. We had to start giving them uh, baking soda. Yeah. And you start doing that too. So, um, every time we come out. Yeah. I've t we've still have kept the grain away. Um, giving them lots of hay in the morning and they are going through that pretty quick um, and then just grazing on the grass and I think I'm just like gonna leave it now. yeah <laughs> I'm gonna leave it like that um, I think for a couple more weeks I'll ask the vet tomorrow about grain I see some people are like don't do it some people give it I don't know I don't know so some people tell you to give them cow's milk some people tell you to do goat milk replacer and we will tell you do the goat milk replacer well, because technically we're using lamb milk oh, replacer, yep. mm -hmm. not goat they they have kid goat replacer um but when i took our the smallest goat to the vet he gave us lamb milk replacer i don't know if that was just because what the local what what's it called farm supply store feed, feed the store, feed store yes. I don't, i'm not sure if that's the only kind that they had um he was very specific about not to get the all kid kind milk replacer he's like it needs to be animal specific and 
He's like, give me the lamb. And so I'm like, okay. So when we ran out of that, we bought more lamb milk replacer instead of kid. Um, but the lamb milk replacer looks like it has a little bit more fat than the kid. Everything else seems to be pretty much the same. So we got like a 25 pound bag of it. Yeah. Wow. And, uh, and uh, it's you want two bags of this? We're, it's we're 60 through. bucks. No, we'll go with one. Thank you. <laughs> I'll probably have to buy another one. I don't know. We'll see. We gotta so they for four months. They need this formula for four months. <laughs> Night bugs. Those beetles, they bite you. Man. Biting beetles. So. Yeah. Anyway. The fun continues on the farm, but but we are seeing an improvement on the goats, so the deworming medicine works. Um we visited his family yesterday, and they told us about some copper bolus mm -hmm. that they give. And I've read about that, so I just need to get some. Um, but I've also read not to give goats dewormer on a regular basis because the worms will become resistant to the medicine. Mm -hmm. um, <laughs> it's <laughs> Goats are just not what I thought they would be. That's a cool they are hilarious to watch and I love having them, but rabbits, chickens, dogs, hardy animals, easy to take care of. Recommend everybody get them. Goats? <laughs> to be continued. A lot more work. <laughs> and, and the lady that we got rabbits from tonight, she's like, oh, have you birthed any yet? And I'm like, no. She's like, oh. <laughs> I'm like, oh. I don't know if I'm ever going to birth them now because I'm scared. <laughs> Stay tuned and we'll keep you updated on our goat's diarrhea. <laughs> Till next time, say a prayer for our family and our goats. And we'll be saying a prayer for yours. Bye. God bless.